the, the legendary lords have their quest battles and you also get missions um, to do and you've got the the chapter um, objectives for your campaign as well. I'm going to keep moving forward into Empire territory towards Altdorf see if I can bring about a massive battle because people want me to kill the Humies don't they? You see my army is still, still healing up a little. Took a little bit of damage in the last few battles. Ooh, Chaos Giants. It'll take me a while to get those though, unfortunately. Yeah. You need to raise some settlements. If you raise some settlements, you get you get more population. It, the, problem was, the problem is, if I stay in one place, I get surrounded. Well, that's why you raise the settlement and you just move on to the next one. Whenever I stay, the enemy turns up in large numbers, so I need to be very careful. Mm. They, they suggest to kill them all. Which kill is them all is a good solution. Yep. The longer I'm around, though, the more uh, chaos corruption oh. affects, which means... What did they just do? They didn't just... No. Oh my God. The more damage I do like this, it pretty much means for... I will be able to slowly but surely weaken uh, a lot of the enemy. So I'm going to go south here. I'm going to go for a settlement that isn't pretty defended, I hope. <laughs> Continuing to add chaos corruption everywhere where I go by simply being in the, the, in the land. Um, I'm adding just lots and lots of wolves. Warhounds. Uh, yeah, warhounds. So I'm going to go for warp bar. Uh, and raise it. It's not got much of a uh, army to defend it, so I'm going to go straight for it. <laughs> Chaos are like Attila Hun in Attila, so yes. We're not doing a stream right. Why don't you level right up to release? Um, there's going to be. I do need we're to gonna, sleep. We're going to yeah. We need to sleep because we need to be in the office in the morning again. Damn, that was and quick. We will be streaming for another hour, and then it's another eight hours, but. You can check out other streams if they're on. Most likely there will be um, on Twitch or watch some YouTube videos. If you feel the thirst for more Top War Warhammer until you can actually play it yourself. And then in little less than nine hours, you can play it yourself. Right, so I've attacked a undead army, which was an interesting decision. I feel... Are they getting, you're getting attacked oh, with... With what's his face? What's he called? This is my second army. Yeah. What's he called? What, the, my second army? Yeah, his, your general. I am no... Okay. Dowie Breaker? Okatar. Dowie Breaker. So Manfred's decided to engage us here, so we're going to go head to head with him, see what he's like. He has a large army of the undead. Very large army, actually. Surprisingly stronger than I thought. Grave guard at the front. Zombies, zombies, skeletons. Zombies, spooky skeletons. Zombies, zombies, skeletons, skeletons, and further away, more skeletons. So where are his strong units? His strong units are... Crypt Ghouls. You said Grave Guards. Grave Guards with great weapons. That's a two-handed there. So yeah. We also have Bats, which are going to be annoying. And over he here, he bat. has one unit Black of Black Knights. Knights. Ooh. And they're also going to be annoying. And where is he himself? There he is. Hello. Yes, he can rename cities. Someone was asking, um, but in Germany... We have that's... that sword. That's the sword we have in... over there. Yes. This one. Ooh. This one. Well, hey. Are you still are you still getting flashbacks now? With me what handing a sword right next to you. <laughs> no. You were stabbing it into the webcam last time. I wasn't. I was stabbing away from the web webcam. But I get it. Um. Yes. So someone was asking how it how it is. For us, um, so so close to such a big release, it's been pretty pretty intense for the last. Pretty. Intense, I don't yeah. I don't remember how how long. <laughs> it feels like an eternity. 
um, coming coming to an end. And I'm pretty sure that goes for the entire company. Um, so it's really, everyone's really looking forward to tomorrow. Um, it's quite an achievement. Wait, so... Ah, uh, so the Shaggers are single units, like, mm -hmm. like Kolek. Yep. Ah, no, I get it. That's wrong. I, I didn't manage to recruit one yet, so I didn't know. Um, there is a tutorial for Top War Newcomers, yes, at the start of the campaign, and you can, you can either select to actually play it or to don't play it, so it's, it's down to you. Um, Ah, uh, such power. I'm not quite sure about the specifics, but I believe this is quite a powerful machine. So it's probably got... Yes, we've got Titan in here. Titan, okay. It's pretty beasty. Yes, there are multiplayer campaigns. That's... Um, yeah, you can play... Um, head to head and co op campaigns as well. Yes, some factions. Can, Depends on the factions. <laughs> Will there be t shirt giveaways? I don't know. No, we don't have, we don't have t shirts to give away. No, no t shirts to give away. Um, so. And I'm the community man uh, community coordinator on Top War Belt's Kingdom. I'm trying to just bog down these Black Knights uh, while I deal with the rest of their army with stronger units over here. As you can see over here, my uh, these guys should be able to slowly just mop them up. Oh, Manfred has decided to fight an entire arm, uh, unit of Chaos Warriors. Let's see how that goes for him. But he's probably confident as well then, just like the last guy. Yeah, most likely. My, my big worry Very right confident. now is that my... Uh, my warriors don't really hold together too long. We're burning over on that flank. I'm going to pull this you now because I didn't want them to fight against spears. And I'm going to bring them over here to charge into the back of these zombies. Because he's a grave guard as well and they're going to be really painful. He's using magic as well which is going to be very dangerous. I need this flank to win as quick as possible. But the problem with these units is they're like tar pits. They just slow you down for a long, long yeah. period of time. It won't be long until these Black Knights escape. How are you saying that? They are losing. They are losing, fighting uphill. And I've just got loads of Chaos Hounds. And they are winning that fight. How how useful do you think are Chaos Hounds? Because I, well, I didn't feel like just they beat, were. If they just beat those units, then I'm quite confident that they are well worth like, their money. Other than taking out like artillery, um, that kind of thing. Just well, when you when you try and flank and you, you get get in behind them then but like I said if they can win a fight like that then they are worth their uh, uh, weight in gold especially because Black Knights could have really just done me in in this campaign so I'm gonna pull away from fighting with um, Manfred here and double back onto this group here I want this fight over as quick as possible this one is actually gonna be quite worrying as well but I've got these chaos I'm gonna put them into a quicker move formation here. I'm winning over on that flank, and this flank is, is ending quite quickly as well. So I'm going to try and move quickly. <coughs> Once again, he's bringing Manfred back in. I'm going to pull these guys out. Okay, we've got um, three questions. So what what unit does Sigvolt get? Um, and what is that? I think he can, he can into the on, a, into the on a chaos into the There we go. Yes, that's what I needed. Maybe we can have a look at him later um, if we unlock him. Um, it's what a are, really close fight. What do you think is the best Chaos unit? Best Chaos unit? I mean, standard. These Chaos Warriors are really, really good. Um, they're cheap for what they are. I would say they're probably my favorites. But if I had to pick anything, I would say Chaos Spawn or or Forsaken. Forsaken are really powerful. There's a unit yes. sitting on the I won, top of the... I won, I won, yeah, I won. There we go. Yes, it's over. Got it. I can't believe it. We fought, fought downhill against that cavalry, which is probably the reason why we won. <coughs> but they eventually broke our center, and we did lose our dragon ogres over here. But just in time, it should be okay. Oh, 
can't play yet. We rally, it'll be okay. But it's Grave Guard. Oh, this is still a close fight. What's your favourite green skin unit, both of you? Uh, black Orcs? I really black like orcs, Black Orcs. Yeah. They're just, they're just, they're cool. All right, we're winning this. We're wrapping it up. This flank over here should break soon. I'm gonna pull uh, my dogs out again because I don't want them to die just yet. I didn't un unlock all of the units yet. If I, I, th I really like the, um, uh, the Doom Divers. Doom Divers are pretty fun. Pretty fun. Takes Doom Divers are brilliant. And the Arachnorog, of course. Having, having built our real life Arachnorog <laughs> about yeah. a dozen, no, not. Not well, really half a dozen do times. Um, oh, they're yes, all breaking I, now. I like the Arachnorog. It's a good thing. Uh, getting getting surrounds on the um, on vampire accounts is really important because as soon as that happens, you start to get the crumble mechanic, which is what we see now. Mm. They're just disintegrating. And literally, yeah. when it happens, that's what happens. Gone. Crumble. Everything is gone. And it's just us now chasing down Manfred himself. <coughs> Chaos armies, even though they're small, are incredibly powerful. And there you go. Decisive victory. Another one was favorite dwarf units. I'm going to go first with mine. I would say the... Oh, God, I had it. Um, the ones with the flamethrowers. Um, what are they called? The... What are the flamethrowers called? And the, the dwarf units. Uh, God damn it, I had it in my head and then Hellfire? I forgot. Oh, the parry units. Oh, they've got a cool, cool name as well. I can't remember yes. what mad. Kill. Oh, chat, please help me. Dwarf units with... Iron Drakes. Iron Drakes, that's it. God. Cool name. Oh, I had it in my head before I said it, and then it was gone. Um, Iron Drakes, my favourite. Yours? The dwarves? Favourite hammers. Dwarf units? hammers. Hammers. Hammers, hammers, followed by uh, more hammers. Hammer time. Indeed. Indeed. Hammer time. Right. Okay. What's up? What's the official time we can play? Okay, for anyone who hasn't um, been watching for a while, it will be in eight hours and forty-eight minutes. That's when it unlocks. So, eight a.m. BST. That's British summer time. 9 a.m. CEST, that's Central European Summertime, and Midnight Pacific. I believe that's correct. And everything else, you can you can triangulate, I hope, from where you are in the world and where we are. Indeed. Okay, Raven Kelleran is off to bed. Sleep well. And have, oh dear God! Have fun tomorrow. Oh, what's happening? That's another two vampire count armies t uh, coming my way. Well, there might just be smaller armies, though. You never know. They are not small. Yes, ignore steam. That's two large vampire armies, but they are weak units, so maybe we should be okay with them. Um, you know what? Well, the game These vampires are getting on my nerves. I'm, gonna attack I'm them. not sure. Is that a 4K resolution with the really wide. Um, I hate these vampires. I'm going to go for them. I would. About the resolution question, <coughs> put it in the forums and they will, they will. we will let you know there. I'm going to go for the vampires. Gonna try and take them out. So how many codes have we got left to give uh, out? We've got some we have left. loads. Yeah. We also have loads of chaos as well. So, we're going to give this one away. So, I'm going to I'm going to put in the first two parts of the code. The steam code goes Damn, into that's a big army. redeem, yeah. Uh, activate activate product on steam. So, I'm going to put that in chat. Oh my god, the And then I'm color. going to tell you the last five digits. Okay? But don't spam the chat because then you're not going to see it. And don't raffle. Okay. Right. 
So. Do you know English Morse code things? No. What is English Morse code? Well, whatever. Not Morse code. The Alpha Tango, whatever it is. Because I always, I always come up with the wrong ones because so I never again, learned it. Again? No, don't spam raffle. Don't spam raffle. Right. Okay. So this is the code. Now the, the last five characters. Don't spam button a few times. It's A for Alpha, I for India, V for Venus, N for Neptune, and finally, V for Venus. I've had a novel idea. How do I get a job at CA? I would apply. Check out our um, jobs site on creativeassembly.com. Spam filters, general settings. Are you are you going to spam? Uh, stop stop spamming. Yeah. Yeah, I that'd mean, be nice. I, I could just do that. I mean, hold on. Dashboard, do 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 do. Uh, Got it. Did someone get it? Guardian Tour. Got it. Awesome. Well done, sir. Good stuff. You're welcome. Right. Um, and for Nancy. Well, it's all. You know. Yes, it was. No. No, it wasn't really that. I, uh... Right, I need to read this. <laughs> I, uh, I added raffle um, yeah. to our band words. Yeah. <laughs> and now people get... Oh. Guys, don't do raffle. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to fight a big battle now against yeah. the vampires. So let's get this on the way. Um, it's my first Total War game. Any tips and tricks to know? Should have blocked them saying hours ago. Yes, and I wish I had. I am so sorry. Please forgive us, chat. It's a learning experience. What? Oh, should have done it ages ago. Stop them from doing raffle. <laughs> raffle. And then raffle. they can start doing raffle. But I, I'm, I'm sure uh, anything goes coming. It will never work. Fight the good fight. Yep. Right, okay, we have a massive vampire army coming for us. And it's dark, very dark. So the reinforcing army is going to come over here. I might start here. Yeah, I'm going to start over here. They don't have any range units, which makes it amazing. So with this method, you're just giving keys. Well, yes. Um, we're, we, are, we are fully aware that this is this might not be the most... Sophisticated method of giving away keys. Most um, definitely. And un unfortunately, we were, but we are bound by this process right now. So, so it's either says it's either this <laughs> or or no free copy. So. You choose. Should we get one more tweet before we end? Last yeah. hour? Last 40 minutes. What are Chaos Victory Conditions? Victory Conditions are to uh, destroy Britonia Empire in short and for a long victory, Dwarfs, Britonia and uh, Empire. That's a good point. I can just turn off either ways now as well. Wait, wait, wait. Yes, I, I guess I was looking for the NATO phonetic alphabet. <laughs> I love chat to an extent. I, n I never went to... But anyway, it, it, you know what? I, I say it happened on other channels and it, it's funny, but what are you going to do? Right. 
I'm going to do another trait. And then, what are you... We're about, what are you we're waiting for? Are you still... big vampire can army. I don't know where they are, but they are coming. They're over there, I can see them. Yeah, on that hill. there's two armies of them, though. Two of them? Yeah, two of them forming up. That might just be slightly unfortunate for you. It'll be fine. You've seen me fight the Lord of Change, for God's sake. At this point, I'm not really worried about some zombies. Is there a multiplayer campaign? Yes, there is. Cobb and head to head. Stay on the hill. Uh, I could do. I, I kind of. I'm not so worried about. Oh, I'm saying that. I say I'm not too worried. And I say grave guard with uh, great weapons. So they're forming up, and then they're going to start marching towards me, I believe. They have a large army. Maybe. You see, I kind of just want to be able to see... Hello, Craig. Hello. Uh, Alright, no. You need to be on speakerphone. Okay, how do I put you on speakerphone? Craig, you're now on speakerphone. You want to be. You want to be on speakerphone. You're so bad at this game that you're fired. Bye. Did you hear that? Oh, for God's sake, Craig. Joey is back. Joey is back. Joey. Someone take Joey. I just got fired again. That's like the second time I've been fired today. Oh, good night. I'm Joey. Joey is back. So, so Joey just popped out on chat and, and Craig called us and called, told us that we're fired. S just seems, me, apparently, because seems of my like lack of skill. Well, I guess I'll just get fired by a proxy. You know what? I'd rather be fired than lose five times in a row at a press event against, uh, against journalists. <laughs> Uh, I think that's probably worse. You poke the bear. Bring it on. There they are. Get them. Oh, yeah. Crypt horrors. Uh, I don't like crypt horrors. They're kind of scary. Bring, yeah, hashtag bring... Free James. Hashtag free James. I Hi, James. I think that the, I'll go the, play Overwatch. The, the only, <laughs> the the only the only hashtag that really should matter is too fast to Horsham. Too fast to Horsham. Too fast to Horsham. It's a glorious uh, tag at which we started not so long ago. Oh, Horsham. Um, Ooh, Craig reminded gosh. me. I probably have to um, explain to people what Horsham is because they won't know. Horsham is where CA is based. Like this is Hors well, this is part of Horsham. So we are in Horsham right now. Um, it's a wonderful. It's a little, wonderful place where wonderful nobody little town goes. In West Buildings. Sussex, in southern England. Oh. Toys R Us! That's Horsham, and Too Fast to Horsham is best. Oh, it doesn't quite work on cavalry in the same way, but still doing some damage. I don't know where that unit went. Give me more magic! You can see we're gonna kind of getting surrounded here. Oh, we didn't see them coming in because they're all their armor is black. No joke, that is the reason why I couldn't see them. Not gonna get the charges out on these guys, that's gonna be painful. Oh man, they just got wrecked. Talking of getting wrecked. Craig playing against journalists is getting wrecked as well. Joey thinks you might have lost it. Oh, oh, what's... No, Joey. No. No, Joey, no. Stop it. No, Joey, no. Joey, what... No, I'm not going to lose. I'm going to win. Eastern Even flank. Even though Kolak has somehow been taken out of the fight before we started. Someone said Eastern flank. Um, Eastern I can flank. see... Well, I guess this is your Eastern flank. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> what is this? That's your Eastern flank. Look at flank. this. I'm holding spacebar. It shows me kind of where they are, which is kind of useful in these kind of fights. 
I'm just going to drop this. Please, 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 whatever happens, do not go towards me. Please don't go towards me. Yes, keep going up, 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 up. No, 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 no. Come back, come back. Don't go too close to my guys. Don't go into my man. Yeah, and it didn't. That's great. Good, good, good. Good spells. Good spells. Dial. What skull? What skull for the skull throne in French? That's my question. Brave guard fighting there. Let's get my uh, my lord into combat. My magic wielders are doing what they can. Zombies coming up behind us. Piers. That's annoying. Can't really cause dread against any of these things, so I'm probably just not going to bother. Just going to keep casting magic. I've got my lord here. Uh, I'm going to bring him in against these scully warriors over here. Okay. Um, this is one of those awkward times in a battle where everything is engaged. Absolutely everything. Dick. So there's not really too much you can do when it comes to fighting. Really? Yeah, because everything is now solidly engaged. Uh, this is my right flank, which is being overwhelmed by skeletons yeah. and zombies. And you can see more zombies just tying me down. I'm probably going to win here. Same here. I yeah, well, the, the, the units aren't as strong as yours, though. Of course, but they have a lot more coming. They have a lot more, yeah. And crypt ghouls and ghouls. more zombies. So I'm outnumbered. Ooh, ghouls. But my guys the are holding the line. So I'm going to put that to the slow mark. You'll be able to see. De Gren pour le throne de Gren? Something like that. That sounds good. Doing a bit of damage, so I might have to pull him out though. Actually, I'm going to do that now before it's too late. These guys are fighting up against uh, skeleton spearmen, which is not good. I need to pull them out. Spearmen yeah. fighting with um, with monstrous ogres and stuff like that, really, really bad. Yep. Same with uh, halberdiers. Yeah. Not good. But zombies, good time. Because they've got armor piercing and they've got um, anti large. Against anti -large. Which is well, halberds have armor piercing, I imagine. Spears. More. But either way, I need to. Do hammer and anvil over here because otherwise it's gonna go it's gonna go horribly wrong. So I'm holding on to my magic, basically waiting to see when I can use what I can. Them charges very strong, and you can see I'm starting to put um, a lot of hurt onto these guys over here, which is really useful. Uh, I can bring the spell to hopefully get more magic. Over here, you can just see this flank is just being slowly but surely overwhelmed. Mm. In I can go for another magic spell in a second. I'm going to go for it now. I need 15, so I'm not far off it. It's going well. Look at this flank over here, though. Slowly getting outnumbered. I'm going to pull this oh, unit yeah, out of combat this. and go into there. Oh, very good. So you've got all spears over there. Can you bring your dragon ogres through through that gap that you have now in the center? I can, but if you pull that spells down again. Oh, it's not gone the way I wanted. It's always got to be careful with those. Well, these spearmen, they're going in. I'm going to bring in everything onto them and hope I can just break them nice and quickly. Not the kind of units I want to be engaging here, but you know they they are weaker units like tier wise. So hopefully I might be able to make an impact. Break, oh, breaking over here. Slowly be able to pull around, but they do have their um, their commander in combat. Crypt ghouls are so deadly. This is a fight we will slowly go our way, I think. Right. More magic is needed, I feel. Lionheart and Warrior Sparta in chat. Yeah, Lionheart wanted to go for a 1v1. If uh, Warrior Sparta's around as well, maybe we can make this a, uh, a 2v2 somewhere. So it looks like the, the army's starting to rout. They're not holding their ground well. Even though they're doing quite well in some places, they're not doing well elsewhere. And that army's starting to crumble. 
I'm gonna pull my um, my lord out. Can can you guys please not spoil anything in chat? Or we're just gonna Uh, Haxo, Haxo said he would um, team up with you. Powering up my guys, giving him a bit more magic, a bit more strength. So we've won that fight over there, that's good. These are spearmen, I don't want to engage them. These are zombies, we're going in boys, we're going in here. Okay, I you brought in, look you've got my, got my lord running with the with these chaos warriors they're going to reinforce my right flank over here yeah which has been suffering but i've been fighting downhill most of the time so it's not so bad the center is going quite well you've got two Ooh. you've got two more chaos units in the center yeah, oh, that's yeah. one not two where does that break where was that break Chaos warriors right there. oh no so over here also struggling to hold but we're doing okay That's where their uh, enemy commander is. I'm going to bring him in to fight those. And there's their grave guard as well. I'm bringing my commander back now. Um, I don't you, need him over there. You don't attach uh, lords to units. No. As far as I know. So I'm bringing back my, my commanders. Along with uh, my... Monstrous calf. Gonna try and hit into the back of these here. Yes. Move around. Oh, the flank broke eventually. We've got some on the hill over there. Just. Yep. This is a close fight. A lot closer than I expected. Look, their uh, crypt horrors are coming back into the fight. Ooh. They look. They do look kind of scary. Oh. I want him down. I want him down and destroyed. So this right flanker where we were mostly worried is now kind of going our way. Oh no! The first time during our live stream. The first time we get a crash. No, no. Oh, that's unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. But that is now, unfortunately, that's the first one we've had on live stream. Yep. That is very unfortunate. God damn it. Oh well. It happens. So with that, I guess it's time for multiplayer. <laughs> Right. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, come on, chat. It was just me kicking the PC underneath because we were about to lose. <laughs> it was making a lot of noise down there. Right. God, it is warm. But that's just because it's in a box. Yes, guys, we got a crash. It's the first one out of possibly... Two yes. hours every day for three weeks? I don't I don't know. It's it's all a blur for me and you just went like in and out and in and out. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna have a multiplayer battle. I'm gonna put it up. We are going to play. Who are we gonna play with? Who's been messaging me? Right. Alright, we're gonna host a there is no password. It's going to be CA live stream. Aha! Right. What was that? Well, someone mentioned. Sorry for that. Someone mentioned uh, the Fnatic Alpha. Now that I have Googled it, I can use that for the next code that we're going to give away. So. Next code, again, like we did before. Oh man, we're getting Don't a lot. Spam raffle. Can another one. Repeat, do not spam raffle. Ah, oh, Leviath. French representing. Boy, I imagine is gonna join us. Um, two more slots, who are we gonna get? I'm going to put in the first two parts of the key, um, which you can, can just um, activate on Steam. And I'm gonna tell you the third part and yeah, I'll well, we'll do that down. So that's the first two parts. Now, 
The first character on the third part is 6, followed by Q for Quebec, followed by the hell? M for Mike, followed by 2, followed by N for November. Can I choose a spec? Never done it before. Don't know if I can. Add IA player, add human player. One more slot, who's gonna join? One more slot. One more slot. Because Steam didn't get the memo. <laughs> Good reason. Right. Let me have a quick pit stop. I'm trying to think of a good map to play, guys. That looks good. Alright, one more. We're going to play on medium funds, so no insanely large armies. <laughs> Could spectate this. So if Lionheart opens a spec slot, and I can join it, because it looks like we're not going to get an extra player. That way, I can watch all of those guys play. I knew that was going to happen. Open a spec slot at the bottom. Hold! Awesome. Haven't done this before.
we're spectating. We're going to be able to watch these guys play it out. Why are there two against three? I think they're going to wait for one more. They did have Levant playing. I don't know where he's gone. Ooh. I hope he joins again. I don't know where he's gone. Who's that? Lord of the French. Where is the Lord of the French? Leviath. Yeah, where is Leviath? If not, I will leave and just join and play. Whoa, Jackie Fish! Woo! Good stuff. Alright, cool. So, on one team we have Hacksaw the Hunter, Warrior of Sparta, Lionheart, Indie Pride. Sorry, on one side we have Hacksaw the Hunter, Warrior of Sparta, Lionheart versus the American Indie Pride. The man from the south of England. All hail Jackie Fish. And all the way from the wastes of the north in Canada, Overkill Total War. Whew! The others are only only English people, aren't they? Yep. Warrior of Sparta and Hexo from the north. From Line, the north. Lionheart is just from around the corner. He is indeed. Down south. Yeah, the, the code is gone already, so no no point reposting it. I guess because he managed to get a trade, get his name trademarked, maybe. You you you'd have to take it to him. Happy birthday. Um, we can't we can't get you that right now. <laughs> Whatever you're asking for, probably not. No. Don't have I King Edition to give away. I'm afraid. Today. But that doesn't mean. Who knows? Alright, cool. Let's get this fight underway. Where is Pixelated Apollo? I don't know. Where is Pixelated Apollo? I don't know. Wherever he is, missing in action. Three more. So guys, who do you think is going to win in chat? Do you think it's going to be Lionheart's army? Or do you think it's going to be Indie Pride Overkill and all hail Jerky Fish? So we're going to go with Team UK versus Team US, Canada and UK. You sound like a British Seth Rogen, apparently. A British Seth Rogen? Yeah. Jackie Fish. Jackie Fish. We could have done... We should have done a, another straw poll asking... Make do one. You, do go. you think Hex of the Hunter, go. Royal Spartan, Nine Heart will win? Go, 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 go. Do it. Yes, no. America with one should token I? English versus free English. Should I go for yes, no again? Yes, go. Royal Britannia or the, uh, or the British Air from Empire. Old Empire. Clon colonial powers. We are ready. We are starting. We are going live. This is the first time we've done this. 
This is the first time we watched other people play here on Castle Draffenhof. The Coalition of the Willing versus the UK. I like that. Coalition of Willa, Willing. And then the bomb just put dog, but... No. Oh, it's sod it. What, what is the other one? Uh, T, uh, uh, Overkill, Jackie Fish, and, and Indie Pride. Overkill, TW. Just waiting for everyone to load in. There we go. Overkill, TW, Indie Pride, and Jackie Fish. Jackie Fish. With IE, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes. No. Create. Teach us the hotkeys. Um, I don't even know the hotkeys. Is that bad? Let us know what you think. No, no. For God's sake, did you put yes and no in there again? Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to see what it gets. Oh. There was no like deployment. It just went, oh no, there is a deployment. I'm not going to show anyone the deployment. Because I don't want anyone to cheat by watching the stream. How we'll win. I like that. That's how oh, I no. How we'll win. Good, good catch. Um, I'm just going to blame the fact that that's my second language and I've been up since eight, seven. Six. So, how Five. we'll win, yes. But yes and no is there because um, I... Put that in the first poll, um, and I'm, I'm, I think the chat is wrong. I think Jackie Fish, Indie Pride, and Overkill are going to win. Why do you think that? Yeah, just got a feeling. Why? Why are we looking at trees when because we could I don't be looking at armies? Zone. Oh, okay. Fine. I think they've started. No, they're still deploying. When that timer oh, well, starts, oh, God damn it. when that timer goes, God damn it, fuck. then it's time for bow. So oh, until then, yes. love my cinematic shots. Oh, God damn it. Okay. I need to turn that off. On this moon, we will see an epic bow. Between on the moon, not on the moon. Possibly some of the maps do look like it. Ah, oh, look at look at the skeletons in the trees. Nice. That skeleton looks like it's got a very long leg, but it's just something hanging off its leg. Yes, the rope. It's very unfortunate. Looks like they've been hanging from hanging there for quite a while. I think they're done. Everyone's just going doot doot. I think they're done. No, they're not. Oh, oh. Not yet. No, I'm still waiting. There we go. Game is away. So this is what we have here. We have over on this side. It won't actually show me the player, so that's annoying. I have to just kind of guess. So we've got orcs on one side. That's a good point. I don't even know who's who's who in this. The release time depends on your time zone. It's 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. So 
in eight hours and ten minutes, um, 8 a.m. BST, British summertime. So eight hours and ten minutes. I think Lionheart's Chaos, if I remember rightly. So this is this is Lionheart's force over here. So this is Lionheart's alliance. Ooh, that's sturdy. And who's been saying who's winning? Um, the majority, 42%, although that's slightly skewed because um, 25% said yes and 11% said no. Um, but it's 40, 40%, 42% in favor of Lionheart. Warrior oh, Sparta and this. Hatch of the Hunter winning. Doom Divers firing on the Dwarven Artillery over here. They got more reach. It's a bit of a gun line right now. Hex Wraiths over on this side. Ooh. Yes, uh, just trust us. Yes, that would be 9 a.m. in Denmark. So that's a lot of organ guns. That's a and the cannons are firing away. Ooh, those Doom Divers. They are amazing, aren't they? Show me if I click on that. I don't think so, because you're spectating. Oh, that would be awesome. That would be quite cool. So Jackie is the Empire over here. Um, I would, I, I don't quite, Whoops. I Indie don't Pride know exactly what it is in EST, in but you can just Google that, if in doubt. So both sides are being a bit careful here. Indy Pride is moving up with his uh, undead. It's an undead party over on this side. So it looks like Lionheart's Alliance is moving forward. The U team of UK is moving into... Oh, this is going to be nasty. Chaos Warriors are getting hit by Doom Divers. <laughs> Amazing. Wonderful. You can see over here, an ambush is awaiting. Right, Black so... Black Knights. Look at these, gang. So... Ready on this flank. Okay. This is our red team, yeah? Yeah. This is Jackie Fish with the Empire. Yeah. Orcs, that is Overkill. And the Vampires here, that's Indie Pride. Yeah. So they, they look a lot more spread out. This artillery line hasn't really had a chance to fire yet. Obviously, Except the, from the, the cannons dwarfs, here. The dwarves won't move much because there's not much point. No, they'll, 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 wait, they'll wait for, for the enemy. But that's kind of... If you if you play together with the, with the dwarves, that kind of ties your tactics down a little bit to doing the same thing because you don't want to pull, pull apart your whole line, right? Very much so. But that's why it's forced uh, a reaction over on this right flank. Because those Doom Divers, you see, the artillery that they have with mm -hmm. these cannons yep. are being outgunned because flame cannons and uh, organ guns haven't got quite the range. But there you go, they're starting to fire and look straight away onto those Doom Divers. And those shots are going into the Savage Orcs behind. Savage Orcs have no armor at all. Mm. So that is just insta kills when they hit. Oh. I'm trying desperately to get some damage off with the uh, Doom Divers though. Oh, that was a miss. Yes, we are spectating game. We are spectating a game between Lionheart, Warrior Sparta, and Hacks of the Hunter versus the Coalition of the Willing in Jackie Fish, uh, Indie Pride, and Overkill Total War. So you're going to see a grudge match over on this side between the Empire of Jackie Fish against the Chaos of um, Lionheart. And he's got his Dragon Ogres. There's some gunfire there from the handgunners, which is really good because they're armor piercing, so they'll do a lot of damage. The other thing I'm worrying, wondering about this, because there's such a such a long line of of your armies, you don't have much room for your cavalry to to Ooh, look at this charge. To move around. The, the God, oh, that is such a great charge. Ooh. Getting that charge is so important with shot cavalry. It does, it means a lot. But there's that oh. chaos charge as well, oh, right into the Reichsguard on the side. There we go. <coughs> So the engage is pretty fierce over here. You can see this is the first counter of the game. And you can see right now, this is not looking too good 
for the Empire. Well, wow. they got some solid charges off here. And we got a Light Wizard here. Probably going to start using some spells. Yeah, he's, oh, he's going to some boons There you go. Him. Some buffs, I believe, and some yeah. negative ones. Over at the center here, you can see the Orcs are moving forward into the organ gun fire, which is brutal. And then over on this side, we have an engagement between vampire counts and vampire counts. Which, as you can tell, is probably not the most animated of combat. But here's some hex... Oh my god, this is going to be interesting. You could say it's quite animated because they're under. Oh, yo, 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 yo. So this is going to be an interesting fight over here. You can see flying units fighting flying units. you got cavalry over here. And this is going to be a quick charge in by the hex race. These guys are really, really important. They do have Hand of uh, Bajan on them, which means they're not going to be as powerful as they were. But that charge is still really, really powerful. The center, though, is a really interesting one because the Orcs have moved forward. They're in combat. But they've taken a lot of damage. But they're now in the front line here. And those organ guns are not going to have quite the same effect that they were before. Mm. And over here, Empire doing a good job over on this side. Holding down what was that chaos charge. But there, oh, look at that. you got the one and only. There is a Kolak fighting in combat. And is that, that is Cole Franz on horse. He's fighting against Kolak. So that's the left flank over here. And you see the gunners firing into the Chaos Warriors, doing what they can. Forsaken are in combat versus Savage York. Savage Orcs are really good units. They don't have much armor, but what they don't have in armor, they definitely have in combat power. Mm. And this here is a desperate fight for the Empire because they're not as good as Chaos Warriors. Chaos Warriors are much, much stronger. Some Orc boys here, gonna try and make a gap in the Dwarf lines here. See, they're pinned down. Not looking good for the dwarves in the long term, so this charge here is really important. Oh, massive charge. Just Whoa. barrels through those gunners. Whoa. Those thunderers in deep trouble. So that line is getting close they to breaking point. Them. And here you got Overkill with his uh, flying flying unit as well. What is he going to cast? So he's got Shaman. Is he going to cast? He's casting magic spells at the moment. He hasn't cast anything too crazy. No, no. I'm sure it's not far away. Oh, it's a, it's a big walk, so it wouldn't be... I'm just waiting to see Maybe if the foot Maybe we can see the foot, yeah, the foot of court. That would Over be on this awesome. fight side, it is vampire counts versus vampire counts. Where I think, with, it, with that charge there, I think that is definitely going to put it in Indie Pride's favor. But he is fighting against uh, Wraith Knights, which is really, really difficult to kill. And there you go, that is uh, Kolak Destroyer. Uh, K Kol Kolak Sun Eater is being chased now by Jackie Fisher's Cole Franz on horseback. And then the Orcs came in from the side. What a brilliant charge on that side. You see a lot of uh, help being used on this side here. The Dwarves are holding and it looks like they might have broken this charge in the center. So the center right now is going in Lionheart's team's favor. And that will be, who is that in the center? That is Haxa the Hunter holding his own in the center there. Doing quite well. Against Overkill. It is still in the favor of the opposing team though. So Indie Pride, Overkill and uh, Jackie Fisher winning over on this flank. This is where they're winning big time. So on the right flank, they're winning. Center, though, they are being broken and pushed back. And on the left flank, this is up in the air as well. I think I think Line well, team might do this one. But well, that's that's because they're getting pushed back in the center because they went oh, out. Forsaken. To the Look at these guys. These guys are really, really powerful units. Disgusting in every way, but very powerful. But they, they went out to the flanks because they, they thought, well, we're not going to get to the dwarves in the first place because the dwarves are going to stay back. Yeah. So we're just going to focus all our all our efforts on the flanks. That's why you saw the um, Empire and the Orcs on the other side. Indeed. Um, so you can see on this flank, there's a complete victory and route. So Indy Pride still got some mopping up to do, but he's still got his uh, most of his units. He's got his. Uh, is that no? It's just a wizard. Oh no, it's, uh, that's Manfred on a zombie dragon. So they're still alive. 
But that artillery is still alive in the center, so they're gonna have to deal with it. And Kolak's almost been killed. <coughs> He's been taking some serious damage. But this fight here is brutal in the woods. It's exactly eight hours until release. Eight hours till release. Chaos Warriors still Can't fighting over here. It's a very difficult flank, but you can just see it's messy as there's hell. A lot of, there's a lot of red, not so much yellow and blue. But there you go, Indie Pride coming in with his uh, van guys, and that is that might actually be it, you know. Because with yeah. these guys able to take out the artillery, yeah. and this flank not being as and decisive as it was going to be, look, Great Sword's still alive, Cavalry's still alive, still got a Bright Wizard, still got Cole Franz somewhere. Yeah, and they can, they can encircle the... The, dwarf the fighting in, in the, the woods though is brutal. Ooh, they still have some the race guard as well. The alliance is breaking down over here. Yeah, it looks bad. Great sword, such a powerful unit. Hoping to play this on my cal. That must be a very powerful calculator. But look it's, at these flying units. They're eight hours until it's the, released for everyone. The gun lines have been overrun by these savage orcs. Do you remember what I said before the... And that is it. That's going to be it, guys. That is a complete route. And who did everyone say in chat was going to win? Um, they said... Well, not, not all of them, but most of them said um, Lionheart's team would win. I said, I think Steve, the chat's wrong. Although 20% of the chat was right. And then 30% of chat was um, just amused by my very bad spelling. Right. Oh my god. Trying to get away. There's nothing left. Don't even know who's in there still. Oh yeah, I was just I was just thinking that the the white one was attacking, but Oh, oh it's by himself! Nice. The Slayer King! <laughs> Literally everything is fighting him and he's down! He's and there you go, he dies at the very end there. Wow! Wow! That was pretty. That's, it's like I said. They, that's an they, epic battle. They just ignored the dwarves, and because the dwarves wouldn't really move, yeah, they just focused on the flanks, took the flanks out, and then they could encircle. So there you go. Um, wow. Well, what's remaining? Indie Pride's got six hundred and fifteen, but then again, he is undead, so you know he's gonna have a lot of those left anyway. But yeah, that's a strong performance. Valiant defeat for Lionheart, Warrior, Spider, and Hexel yeah. the Hunter. But they were. It, it was just. They just. The flanks just couldn't hold, like yeah. both, uh, especially where Indy Pride was. That flank completely collapsed. Yeah. But what I think what really uh, tipped the balance is you've got a gun line with artillery, mm. which the dwarves are really strong for, but they're not very mobile. Mm. So what basically you saw there was Overkill and um, uh, uh, Jackie Fish working together. Yeah. So okay, I can't take the center. I can't go up against that gun line. Exactly. I tied them down when I could, but I pulled my cavalry away. Helped the Empire flank, mm. and with there, uh, they were able to turn the chaos uh, yeah. side, win there, and obviously Indy Pride did his thing. Yeah. So, um, yeah, that's the problem with dwarves. They're not very mobile. So, gun line is powerful and all, mm. but, yeah, once yeah. again, that's... Warrior uh, got completely obliterated there by, by oh, Indy Pride. Oh, that, that's, that was... uh, that's just because if you Oh, because are, they crumble. Yeah, if, yeah, if, yeah, if, of if course, you're fine with vampires, you're always going to come away with nothing left. Ah, yeah, yeah. So, that is that. GG on that one. Well, guys, that's going to be it for today. In fact, tomorrow, when everyone wakes up, if you're in the UK, Europe, or uh, if you're uh, really bad at sleeping in America, I don't know. I can, can never work out where America is. When you wake up tomorrow, you will have Total War Warhammer. If you haven't already got it, uh, don't forget to pre-order it now. You do pre-order it before launch, and within a week, you will get the Chaos units as your adopter bonus so don't forget that that will include all three of the legendary lords kolak um Samra, and uh 
and Archeon. So, guys, that's been great. We have been yeah. streaming all day. Yeah, and much. I can't believe it's coming to an end, really. I really need That's to been amazing. Um, like I say, thank you so much for joining us. Yes, thank, thank you, you very so much. much. Um, we Should we give them one more code before we go? How many have we got left? We've got a few left. Two left? Yeah. Let's get them out there. Okay. Let's get two of them out. Okay, how do you want to do that one? Just drop them down. Just drop them straight in the chat. Just drop them straight in the chat. Go, guys. Okay. Here we go. I'm going to listen to you saying that, and then... Oh, okay. So, yeah, like I was saying, thank you very much for joining us, guys. Don't forget to put a sub on the channel. We will be back in the future with a lot more streams. Okay. And we fired one. I want you to fire another. <coughs> all these people have been waiting for us all day. They've been pleasant enough to watch us for that. Did you guys enjoy that last battle at the end there? Please tell me what you thought. Here's Don't always one. forget, hashtag Total War Stream. Let us know what you think about that. Let us know what you would like to see in the future. Team JJ will be back, don't worry. But also, Matthias Fischer, the man from Germania. Germania. He will be back as well. Probably at some point. Right. And you know what? Yeah. You know what? I I think one more. One more. One more. One more. Stop hitting I'm, the... I'm going I'm I'm to hit, hit whatever I'm going to hit until I get another code out there. Don't hit the table. So wait until you hear me bang the table and then fire that code into the crowd. If I had a t-shirt gun, I would be firing it everywhere right now. I can't see you. I don't think. No. But I probably can hear you. Okay. <laughs> okay. Fire! Have you found it? Max Mellyfoot. Is it gone? Max Mellyfoot can't.